Hi, this is Raheem Zulfikar Ali from excelbasement.org. This is video number six related to Excel count functions for AFC4 students introduction to information technology. Let's proceed with the video. In this video, we will learn four count functions. The first one is a simple count function. Purpose, get the number of numbers. Uh, we will have a count of the numbers. Return value, a number representing a count of numbers. Then syntax is equals to count, round bracket open, value 1, comma, parameter 2 is value 2, which is optional, and so on. Parameter list, value 1, an item, cell reference, or range, value 2, optional, again an item, cell reference, or any range. The count function counts the number of numbers in a supplied values. Values can be items, cell references, or ranges. For example, equals to count 1, 2, uh, apple, that is text, which is in inverted commas, returns 2, answer. And count A1 till A10 will count the number of numeric values in the ranges A1 till A10. As count, do not count the text. It only counts the values, numbers. Count can handle up to 255 additional values, right here, value 1, value 2, up till 255 values. Use count A to include text and logical values. Use count if to count based on criteria. Uh, to count the text in the range or uh, name ranges or something else, logical values, you have to use count A and count if, whereas count simply gives you the count of a numeric values. Okay. Note that error values or text values that cannot be forced into numbers are not counted. The logical values true and false are not counted also. Empty cells and text are also not counted in count function. Okay. Next is count A function. The purpose count the number of non-blank cells. Returning value is a number representing non-blank cells. Syntax of count A is equals to count A, round bracket open, value 1, comma, value 2, and so on. Parameter list, value 1, an item, cell reference, or any range. And then value 2, that is optional, an item, cell reference, or range. Usage notes. Use the count A function to count cells that contains numbers, text, logical values, error values, and empty text. Count A does not count empty cells. Count A will also count items, for example, equals to count A, A, which is text, 1, 2, 3, and an inverted commas space, which will return the answer 5. These are 5 values. Use count to count numeric values only. Okay? Count can handle up to 255 values. Next is count blank function. The purpose is that it will count cells that are blank. Returning value, a number representing blank cells. Syntax is equals to count blank and we will define the range. Parameter list, range, the range in which to count blank cells. Usage notes, use the count blank function to count blank cells in a range. For example, count blank starting from A1 till A10 will count the number of blank cells in the range from A1 till A10. Count blank count the number of cells in the range that don't contain any value and return this number as a result. Cells that contain text, numbers, errors, etc. are not counted. Cells that contain formulas and return empty text are considered blank and will be counted. Cells that contain zero are considered not blank and will not be counted. The last function is count if function. The purpose is count cells that match the criteria. Returning value will be a number representing cells counted. Syntax is equals to count if round bracket open range and then criteria. Parameter list 
first is range the range of cells to count and then criteria the criteria that controls which cells should be counted usage notes count if counts the number of cells in a range that match the supplied criteria non numeric criteria needs to be enclosed in double quotes but numeric criteria does not for example 100 and uh, we have a value that is greater than 32 and we are finding gem or a1 where a1 contains a number you can also use wildcard characters that is quotient mark and steric can be used in criteria a quotient mark mas matches any one character and an steric matches any sequence of characters okay so let's have them in excel spreadsheet uh, one by one equals to count bracket open and i am selecting the range from a3 till a7 bracket close when i press enter i get 3 as only counts the numeric values count a equals to count a again selecting the same range in different column bracket close it gives me 4 as now it's count text and the values whereas it's ignore the blank cells if i put a space here and press enter it it will count uh, this cell also for count blank equals to count blank select the range bracket close it returns one as it only counts the blank cells i hope these are three simple functions and you have understood them let's move toward the count if i have three columns the first is sales representative names states and sales and and i have asked uh, three questions and i have to give the answers the first is count of sales over 100 count of sales by rahim and count of sales in the state ki that is karachi so equals to count if i will select the range i have to count the sales over 100 which is the sales column amount column i will select this comma and in inverted commas i will put greater than 100 inverted commas close round bracket close and i got one okay next is count of sales by rahim equals to count if range comma and inverted commas put rahim so so two sales have been done by the rahim and the last is count of sales in ki equals to count if select the range of states comma and inverted commas ki so two sales have been made in the state of ki okay as I put uh, in the first example is count of sales over 100 as 100 is equals to 100 so I have to put the greater than and equals to sign to get the correct number if the sale is accurately 100 uh, figure or uh, more than 100 if I don't put the equals to sign here so it will only pick the greater than 100 not exactly 100 so I have to put greater than and equals to here as, as an expression and i will get the current correct count of uh, that we have two sales uh, greater than or equals to 100 so this is how we uh, apply count a function by selecting the range and we define the criteria okay i hope you understand all these four functions for any queries or feedback do email me at rahim.zulfikarali at live.com thank you